Ahoy my friends, Ryder here. Welcome back to another Final Fantasy VII Ever Crisis video. Today is the day guys. We are getting the final week 7 video that is going to drop. I have not watched it. I'm hoping we're going to get guilds, although the data mine suggests otherwise. That being said guys, I'm going to jump over to the Twitter page without any further ado. And we are going to watch this finale of this very long seven week half anniversary campaign together. We've been going through it together this whole time and let's finish strong. All right, guys. So this is it. Three, two, one. Let's go. There it is, the high wind. We knew it was coming. What do you guys think? Do you guys think a banner is coming or do you guys think guilds are coming, all right? Pause it right now. Let me know in the comments below. Take your guesses. Let's rattle them up and let's see what it is. All right, three, two, one, boom. All right. It looks like... Let's pause here for a second. Let's go back on this screen a little bit. Hold on, let me get back here. All right, so it does look like it's some type of gathering system here. Enhancement, battle, collection, which is what the data mine was kind of suggesting. The high wind is something that you can kind of send out on these expeditions to find you battles and potentially gear. All right, so let's see. All right, it looks like there's new materials here for enhancing. I'm just gonna let the video play out and then we'll come back. So it looks, there you go, boss enemy spotted. Oh shit. I think I know what this is. Oh, Shiva's getting unlocked. Next level, let's go. All right, guys. Well, let's go back. Honestly, a tiny bit lackluster, in my opinion. Shiva's, it looks like Shiva's growth board is getting updated. So let's take a look at that. That will come back. So it looks like Shiva's summon stream will be updated as of April 17th. Um, I guess this is kind of glitching out right here. Let's revamp this and bring this back. We'll open it up one more time. Go find Shiva. All right, so this is what I wanted to look at right here. All right, guys, so it looks like Secret of Magic Arts. This can boost magic attack. I'm guessing this might be like a way that we can further improve weapons and abilities. So like right here, it says boost attack or boost magic attack. So it might, it says here all characters. So maybe these are actually books that we can use on individual characters to level them up even further beyond the growth, uh, beyond the growth board. Yeah, so this one has physical attack. Secrets of the Great Sword, physical attack. Um, what else do we have here? Magic attack. Um, here it says, uh, Aerith's weapons raised to level 50, progress zero out of one. Okay, so this is how you level this up. Aerith's weapons raised to level 90. So depending on how many of their weapons that you have leveled up, you're gonna get more of a boost. Oh, this is how this is going to work, I guess, guys. So basically, Aerith, or no, all characters are going to be enhanced. Oh no, it looks like, yeah. It looks like in order to raise the magic attack of all characters, certain things are tied to the level of certain characters weapons so like for example right here Aerith's weapons raised to level 50 is going to improve magic attack if you raise Aerith's weapons to level 90 it looks like even just one will raise it by 0.1 percent magic attack to all characters um and it does look like you might need this book in order to enhance these i don't know guys i'm actually pretty curious so we're gonna have to see what this looks like in the game itself um 
it is kind of interesting. It is going to be a new way to level things up. Other than that, we have Shiva's new summon stream right here, which I'm guessing is just going to unlock more growth nodes for Shiva. Um, she's going to be the first one. She was the first summon unlocked. No, I think Ifrit was the first summon unlocked in the game, guys. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure Ifrit was the very first uh, summon that we ever fought. So interesting here. It does look like, as you guys can see, Diamond Dust is going to be able to go to level 10 now, guys. Level 10. All right. That's pretty freaking crazy. So five more levels for Diamond Dust. Honestly, it is pretty sick for Shiva. I'm not going to lie. I'm pretty stoked to get that. The High Wind, I really was hoping the High Wind was a guild system. I feel like guilds would be so cool. We know they're coming. I'm guessing they're just trying to like perfect every little detail, make sure that it's perfect for when they launch it to us. I thought that the High Wind could have been like a really sick base, base of operations for a guild. I feel like a lot of us felt that way, but it is going to be what it is, guys. And I'm going to jump back over to the game here. I'm curious, what do you guys think of this launch? I thought we might get a new banner. I guess we're not. I still think that there's a good chance we get a Final Fantasy 16 crossover. If we do, we should get news of it sometime in the next week or two. Um, so I'm going to wait until like the 19th or the 20th, I think. Maybe, yeah, probably the 20th. And then if there's no news about it yet, then I might just do some pulls for Tifa's Water Arcanum costume, which I think will be very, very useful in the future. As you guys could see on this most recent dungeon ranking event, you know, Zack's Fire Arcanum costume was really, really helpful. And I think that having the magic version of each Arcanum, you know, slowly over time, don't go crazy out there, guys. Um, but I think it's going to be something really important to push forward with all character builds in this game. Doesn't matter, free to play whales, dolphins, minnows, etc. I think moving towards a physical magical set for each element is going to be a good idea. All right, guys, that being said, I was super stoked to share this with you guys today. Thank you guys for hanging out. And yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to drop a like, sub to the channel for future content. And yeah, hope you guys all have a wonderful night. Take care and peace.